North Dakota ag groups and NDSU officials are asking the state legislature to support a new ag research center on campus. Harris Hall has been the home to some world-class developments over the past 60 years, but it needs to be replaced. The plan is to move food sciences, plant sciences, the meat lab, and the Northern Crops Institute to a new, larger, and more modern building. Jenny Schlecht has more in our cover story from the Capitol. It's our future. It needs updating. We need the facility to keep the cereal scientists going, uh, the meats laboratory. Farming has changed dramatically in the last 50 years from genetics to precision ag. But unfortunately, the more than 60-year-old NDSU building that houses world-class ag research is showing its age. The current problems in the building include the water. A lot of the labs don't have running water to them because the pipes are corroded and just plugged. A lot of the ex expensive analytical equipment we can't have in this building because we don't trust the power surges and, and it, just, it just ruins the machines. Other issues, leaking roofs. And when you have leaking roofs and that falls in, into your equipment, it, it, it's not good. NDSU's Vice President for Agricultural Affairs says investments in ag research have a great return, not just for students and researchers, but for everyone in the state. Greg Lardy says other projects on campus have already shown similar benefits. So this is going to do the same thing for our food science and cereal science and meat science programs. Really get students excited about those potential careers and studying those, in, those discipline areas, but also uh, uh, really help us attract and retain those scientists and teachers and faculty members that are so critical to making these programs successful. The bill would allow the state to finance $64 million for the project, which includes the Ag Products Development Center and the Northern Crops Institute. $14 million would be raised privately for the projects. We think it's a high priority to make sure that we have um, a modern, up-to-date facility that we can put our world-class scientists to work in. The bill has passed the Senate, but the House must still vote on it. In Bismarck, this is Jenny Schlecht for Ag Week.